That is not a love story. It is that a is love story with a little bit of action. Just my kind of movie. It's basically like no man. That she oh, didn't no, Joel was the best she friend. She didn't Joel. He died. They turned, that movie I've never finished watching that whole uh, thing. Because you you know why? Because no, as soon as the no, bra no, started no. jawling with oh, his bras, his dead bras he girl, died. then I saw broke out. I'm loyal. Me. Yeah, you can call and say, like, just for the record, so you know, none of my friends <laughs> come and console nothing here. <laughs> Only your girlfriends can come, but to console. Exile, you're a spook. <laughs> Hello! So it is a Valentine's Day week and I thought it is time for us to give you our top 5 favorite Valentine's Day movies, rom-coms and love stories. But Natalie, I'm going to go first because I know you're going to say the obvious things. What is my obvious thing? You don't know my number one. But I don't know. I can tell you. Pretty Woman? No. Notting Hill? Number 5. Hey! Papa is weird dark. What else is there? What would you else would you say? I don't know. Let me tell you what else you would say. Nothing Hill has to be on the list. Come on now. It is an all-time no, favorite it is a good romantic. One. Yeah, but movie. it is. It's also like it, everyone's watching it. It's always playing on TV. It's frot I like a Nothing Hill, and it's weird. I like to catch a movie, a popular movie, a movie that I like like that. It must come on TV, even if it's on streaming. I won't watch it on streaming. But if it just rolls on no, to my no. TV screen, then I'm in. Nothing Hill is one of them. Okay, so give me your five. My number one all-time favorite. Start with no four. One, no one can argue with me. Oh, okay, go, okay, go, number okay, four, go. Number four then. Number uh, four. Now what's your number four? Uh, I jumbled them up. I, it's just like a general number. Me before you. Me before you? I haven't seen that. It's where the guy is... Um, He's in a wheelchair. Oh, and, we saw that. Yeah, and, and the girl has to take care and of him. Soft him and falls in love that was good. It was good. Beautiful. I wouldn't beautiful. put it in top five category. No, no, definitely but not top five. It gets a chunk. Everywhere where I chunk is a top five. I mean, I chunk everywhere. So it, sometimes even the lotto numbers come out, I chunk. No, no. Um, and number three. No, what's yours? Give no, you give me your five. Okay, number three is someone great. What's that? I don't think you've watched it. It's actually, it's not, it's a recent movie. It's where the girl breaks up with a long time boyfriend and then she has these two best friends and then they go to, um, on holiday together. Uh, <laughs> girl it's power. A, it's a girl, it's a very girly movie. It's the same I story. Really, really like Traveling pants. No, I really like that movie. Traveling pants is Easy a prey, movie. love, love, eat in the prey and the beans. Oh, so Top. It's the same story. And you okay? Okay, number two on my list is all time favorite The Notebook. The Notebook is good, but it is also one I knew you would have in your list. The Notebook's good. There's only a few good mm. movies. And what There's else? not a lot. All of your stuff isn't rom coms, it's heavy stuff. So it's heavy, beautiful, and number one? in depth <laughs> love stories. Oh, yeah. Gives you perspective <laughs> of your it? relationship. <laughs> Fuck. Anyway, okay, so oh, number one. Number one, without a doubt, no argument. Ik het gechang, die jelle movie. En hij was um, action, Pearl Harbor. That's not though. That is not a love story. It is that a is love story with a little bit of action. Just my kind of movie. It's basically like, no man. That she oh, didn't no, Joel was the best she friend. She didn't Joel, he died. They turned, that movie I've never finished watching that whole uh, thing. Because you You know why? Because know. as soon as the no, bra no, no. started jawling oh, with his please. bras, his dead bras he girl, died. then I saw broke out, I'm loyal, me. Yeah, you can call and say, like, just for the record, so you know. None of my friends <laughs> come and console nothing here. <laughs> Only your girlfriends can come back to console. Exile, you're a spook. <laughs> anyway, my top five is different. Very quickly I, I, off the it's, topic. It's not a top five. I just put out a list so that 
you know, I knew Nike was going to say certain staples, you know. And then also in that staple category, I thought she was going to say pretty woman because Richard Gere or like my mother says, Richard Gay. Hey, hey. You know, the aunties like a Richard Gere. That is, there was a sex symbol of the 80s, that bra. Richard Gere actually did a few, eh? Um, so, pretty woman, I was gonna say. Uh, I thought you were gonna say, and the notebook, I thought you were gonna say. Not in your life, what you were gonna say. So, I'm gonna throw in a five that maybe you didn't watch that is going to be tops. First of all, this is also a classic City of Angels. Remember City of Angels? Yeah, beautiful. The bra's name is Seth. Beautiful. More bro, beautiful. City of Angels. And then I also like, sometimes you don't want something too heavy. You want a light experience, a fun thing. It's complicated with Meryl Streep. That's liquor. Yes, it's, it's a lovely movie. It's not heavy. It's the beautiful romance that gives No, it doesn't. It's Valentine's Day movies. It doesn't have to be Jamie Joe No first career when he's not much No. Of course, you must, you must first career. That is one of them. This one, I know you're gonna. You, you have you, about time. Have you seen about time? It's you know about movie. that one is very good. I love that one, and I like that Englishness about it. Really good, right? Uh, another one I quite in there, and I know you're gonna smart this one. Time traveler's wife, the time traveler. Yeah, I liked it, but it wasn't like my favorite. Because you're dead inside. <laughs> <laughs> and and this is not my number one. I'm just putting them my randoms. Is Wimbledon? Have you seen Wimbledon? Mm -mm. It's about a guy that's ending his career and he plays Wimbledon and he falls in love. And it's, a it's a nice love story. It's also like very, there's comedic moments which make it soft. And then on my other list, my, my honorable mentions and my, my personal favorites, When Harry Met Sally. No, I know Natalie, don't smart that. It's okay. It's a long movie, but I like the dialogue. I'm a big fan of, of the of actors. Harry and Sally. Absolutely. And what else did I put here? Um... Yeah, that's it. That's like a, that has to be in there. And also, I like the bodyguard, but I don't know if it's like mention worthy. I just put those in there so that you guys have maybe some new things to watch, man. Did he sell a pearl harbor? Is that Did all? Did he sell a bodyguard? Just as people watch the bodyguard twenty million times, they're looking for inspiration. No, they're looking Hello. for that, bro. I like a nice, nice combination of killing and love. <laughs> Pearl Harbor, exactly, that's why I said Yeah, but with a little bit that of a bra, jawling with these bras, oh, dead so. bras, name, and sis, that is what you like, that is what they like. <laughs> From once, and the look of his yelte for the man. So say that he has a character, I'm not. No, but the man, the other man, the chick, who are much more than a little. Anyway, that is enjoy your.